I'm Maya. I'm Julia. We line up and welcome back. So the month has we Mother downgraded Mary. again. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> the month of May has passed so fast. And let's show you guys our monthly favorites. So first off is fashion. I actually have three fashion favorites for the month of May. And the first ones are a pair of sneakers. So I got these pair from Jim Ricky. They're actually gifted to me. And they're just a regular black and white sneaker but with the Velcro straps. And I have not had Velcro strap shoes since I was like five. But dude, they're so comfortable. I mean, they're so easy. You just kind of, you just go, and then you go. And then they're done and then you're ready to go but I think they're super cute they're a black suede and they have a thicker kind of sole so it looks it looks really pretty so yeah and then my second fashion favorite for the month of May is this leather jacket and you guys seen this before because I styled it in our spring lookbook and it's an oversized leather jacket from monkey and I really liked it because I've been looking for a oversized leather jacket for a while and when I saw it in the store I'm like damn I think it looks like it looks a little more expensive than it is it was only 500 crowns so I don't know I just think it's really easy to style and my last fashion favorite is wait for it a fanny pack yes I actually have that one yeah too. actually we got fanny packs and you know because everyone's been styling them sort of like you know like a shoulder or like a side bag when I first saw it, I'm like dude what the fuck is this I'm like I would never and here I, I am. I've been liking that trend and here actually. I am. So. But this one is actually from Brandy Melville and I saw it because I, I saw it at work and I'm like, wait, this one's kind of cute though. <laughs> I'm like, it's kind of fashion or like fashion. It's more like fashion-y or more like on tread street because I like it has big, big silver zippers. So it's more like, it looks prettier. And yeah, I've been wearing that a lot. It's super convenient when you go out because you can dance and you just have it here. You don't have to hold your bag or anything. So yeah. <laughs> and then when I saw it, I was like, Maya caught me that one. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I also have that as my fashion favorite. My other fashion favorite is actually this denim button up. I love oversized lately and I feel like this is actually size 44, which is like extra large. And I don't know, I just been loving like, you know, when you like slightly pull it like, it's not off the shoulder, but kind of. And lately I've always been tucking like half of the shirt in which i think is like adds a really nice detail to the outfit my next fashion favorite is actually this belt and i i forgot to mention it in my previous monthly favorite so it's actually my april favorite but i use it all the time so it's this belt from weekday and i added this belt detail that's from mix mix and that extra detail just does so much to your outfit so i've been i use it for any jean even skirts or just like basically for anything and I think it just adds a nice edger touch to your outfit. And my last fashion favorite for this month are these boots that are from H&M. Oh my god, they are so sexy. They are actually very comfortable for being 9 centimeter heel. But I use them on my on a night out and I feel popping. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on to beauty favorites. Actually, have one beauty favorite. And it's a combo of a liquid lipstick and a gloss. So yes, gloss, gloss has been a thing lately, so I tried it out. And y'all know my favorite liquid lipstick is the, what's it called? I like that you don't even know the name. Yeah, shit. It's number 06 Pusha from NYX. And I got this lip gloss actually in a goodie bag, so I, like, I didn't buy it. <laughs> and it's from, it's from Edlos. It's just like a random Swedish. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, but I, it's a pink sparkly one. I really like the combination of this color with this color <laughs> i don't know i suck at describing it but i think it's really pretty <laughs> my beauty favorite is actually coconut oil i know we've mentioned it before but for this time it's for my hair so as you know i have silver hair and it gets super super frizzy if i don't dry before i go to sleep and if i don't put any oil so before i use like argan oil moroccan oil all that type of stuff it did help of course i usually use coconut oil for my body like after showers and stuff so what i do is after my showers while it's wet i just rub some coconut oil uh, on the ends and it just turns like super smooth and silky and yes oh by the way i cut my hair 
<laughs> Look at that. Yeah. So I actually have quite a few music favorites for this month. I won't mention them all, but you can always check out our monthly playlist that we curate for you guys on Spotify. <laughs> that promos that. <laughs> Anyhow, the first song is a song that I mentioned on in our music mukbang. It's Something Tells Me by Bryson Tiller. Something tells me we ain't gonna last, baby. We ain't gonna last. Have y'all seen the music video, by the way? The girls are so gorgeous. I died. I was like, oh my god. And but it doesn't have anything to no, do with this the song. Music, I, the music video is super like It's random. just random. It's just like visual, I guess. Yeah. But... Anyhow, my next music favorite has been Jeremiah actually. I listened to his old album Late Nights in Europe and I don't know, I just like it's very night late night vibe. <laughs> But my favorite has been Copenhagen and there for you. There for you. There for you. And another music favorite is actually some random artist that my friend Cameron sent to me. He was like, "Oh, this is quite quite good." And he has like below a thousand listens on Spotify, and I was like, "What the fuck? He's actually so good." It reminds me of a combination of Anderson Pack and Frank Ocean. So if you like them, you're probably gonna like. It's called Choker, and I don't know. It was just he was just super good. And the songs that I've been listening to are called Brown Steel. Oh, oh, oh. And diorama. So you can give that a listen if you want. So I have a few music favorites as well. And as you guys know, I was recently in the Philippines. So my friends kind of showed me a few like Filipino artists. So the first one is Jess Connolly, and she made a EP with Crown. And I've known about Crown for a while because I have him on my SoundCloud. And their EP together was really, really good. My favorite songs from the EP are With You and How I Love. And the next artist, I think she's also Filipino, I'm not sure, but she lives in LA. But her name is So Super Sam. And she's a DJ, but she also sings. And one of my favorite songs from her are called Make It Go. And that's actually on SoundCloud, so I'm going to link it to you down below. On the top, my drop top, and my last favorite song is actually by The Game. And it's called Baby You. <laughs> Baby, you know you got me going crazy. You run around my head. So for movie favorites, I actually went and watched Pirates of the Caribbean, the la latest one, like Salazar's Revenge or something. And I thought it was so funny. <laughs> I mean, I don't, it's probably because, you know, you're at the movies and it's a major throwback because we basically grown up watching mm -hmm. those movies. I, I don't know about you. At least I did. Yeah. And I thought Johnny Depp was so funny as usual. And there's this scene where Orlando Bloom and Kiara Knightley reunite. And I'm just like... <gasps> It's so beautiful. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, next up is our favorite outfits of the month. Thank you guys so much for watching our monthly favorites. If you have any favorites you'd like to share, please pop them down below. Otherwise, you can check out our monthly playlist on Spotify for May. Mm -hmm. And yeah, that's it. We'll, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.